Hey guys, welcome to Inspire Chemistry and welcome to the phase two of the video where I'll tell you how to professionally go about your research. So if you haven't watched the first videos, please do have a look at it and we'll give the link in the description box. So do watch that video. So before that, uh, uh, I would like to tell you that please do watch this video till the end where I'll give you a, a small uh, visual uh, visual video on how to actually find the research articles, research reviews and visit this important site for your uh, development. Uh, whatever I speak in the video will be given uh, to you uh, in form of a small um, uh, tutorial in the end of the video. So please do watch. Let's start the video. Hey guys, so let, let's start the video and the very first thing I'd like to tell you is that uh, for starting something you need to have a step, you need to take a step and the step in this case is uh, starting to like look around and choose your field of interest or the field, would you, the field in which would, you would like to work in your future, in your let's say masters or your PhD whatever it is or maybe internship also so you have to take your first step choose the correct field you want so fundamentally the uh, uh, you actually bifurcate chemistry into three branches the physical chemistry inorganic chemistry and organic chemistry and i really believe that there's one more branch of chemistry which is critical chemistry so if you choose any one of them uh, it's all good then you can actually have a direction at least you have a direction like east west north south it doesn't matter how how much degree to the east to the left so you have a direction now you choose one of them then let's uh, then we'll go further with it okay so uh, the way i believe to go about research is to actually through very reliable source the general the publishers themselves so i really believe the way i do it is that i go to these websites like acs uh, american chemical society site royal, so uh, royal society of chemistry site nature science let's say organic letters whichever you want to go these are very uh, uh, renowned ones and they are really really trustable there are actually no question about their okay so if you go to that site the visuals uh, the uh, tutorial will be the end so keep uh, watching the video so if you once you open the sites you'll find that there are different uh, actually different classes uh, sections of research dedicated to different uh, 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 different fields like first there will be some uh, let's say environment energy phase second can be optical devices and engineering biomaterials organic chemistry drugs so all these things are there and you need to actually go uh, choose if you find you they'll have a, some certain like 20 25 fields different uh, um, publications and different uh, different journals you can go to, into them if you find them fascinating you can take a step forward okay so let's just say we go to this inorganic general okay if we find a certain class of this in the site and we we click on it then we'll they'll show you some certain articles which have been published in the this journal in recent time maybe yesterday maybe two days back maybe one week uh, one week back maybe one month back all the other uh, and there will be some sections which tell you that this paper have been cited this number of time and the more citation the more renowned the more useful is the paper the value of the paper they have a certain impact factor and that needs to be considered okay so let's just say we dive into some inorganic uh, pop up with an inorganic general. You see that there are some papers on, let's say, MOF, then there are some papers on COF, and then you see that paramagnetic versus paramagnetic coupling structurally uh, analogous by nuclear complexes. Okay, I think MOF is interesting. Let's then you click on it. When you click on it, you'll find that article and they will have certain references and related articles to it. So now you have a very specified direction where you are heading, correct? So that's how you have now come up to like three steps into the research. And um, uh, you can actually what uh, the way I believe is that not straight away diving into article uh, research articles. You should start your way through a more broad and less deep things that is provided you by the review articles 
so the 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 review articles are actually very advantageous in the sense that they give you a broader idea of the field the related field you're uh, looking for the developments happening in that particular field throughout the time and the challenges which you will be facing or the uh, current challenges which uh, actually scientists are facing now and what could be the other challenges in the future all these things are covered in uh, article one more thing uh, uh, that uh, article actually if you start reading them you'll find that there are certain tools and topics which you uh, you need to be familiar of you have to have a prior knowledge of those uh, those topics and techniques before reading this article they'll have some studies done on you'll know how to do how do these people studies you 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 will get to know how that i need to know how this is this particular instrument or let's say a spectro uh, uh, this uh, spectroscopy works i need to learn about them uh, uh, before going into this article so that is what a, a research uh, like say review article does to you and uh, in the research uh, this article there will be up some references they'll give a number in the superscript uh, in the boxes and they will give this number to the reference article and the references article are listed at the uh, end of the uh, review article so these each of the article they have uh, uh, you find there is specified to some uh, specific research in relating to that field so first go to a broad thing then you go deep and deep into some specific field correct article review article then uh, spec uh, then uh, suggested journal uh, suggested uh, reading articles then you go to the research article correct and that's how you develop things okay and um, one uh, one of the very important actually very silly things is that if you do visit these sites that if you find something interesting on a the site they'll ask you to can you uh, do you want us to uh, take up your cookies so as you know that cookies are small uh, sites uh, like they have they store of specific information they can always come back to you faster when you want need them the most or the thing it can also do is that it gives you it gives you uh, your google search a uh, um, suggestion that this these are related things you might like maybe le let's say there comes a new article a path breaking article that will be listed in your uh, suggested readings in the google and that is really helpful you are able to access these articles before anybody else you are always updated that's the thing you are always always updated so that's about uh, everything and whatever i spoke i'll be doing the uh, uh, visual tutorial of the same in this particular video so keep following it it will be a short video so stay tuned so this is the video tutorial of this video and for say saving your time i've already written acs on my google search so the first site you see is american chemical society site and the next site is about their journals books and references so if you want to search anything, uh, you can search this in this bar, search publication, articles, authors, etc. And here you can see their list of various publica uh, publications and journals. So the very first one, Accounts of Chemical Research, is very important and it gives you a good outline of the research going on in a broad topic. And it is very, very important. I must suggest this to you. Uh, you should you guys should read about this and then you have biomaterials electronic materials energy materials interfaces biomaterials catalysis let's just go to catalysis and these are lists of editorial numbers let's go for articles and as you can see today is already may 16 and they have articles from May 15th, just a day prior, those who are published and investigation into catalytic role of various substance species and all this stuff. They have articles which were uh, published yesterday, which were which are being published today. You can find any article you want here. Okay, that's about ACS and uh, just to show this, let's just go for this abstract. So abstract gives you a brief outline of what is in the paper so you can just 
read the abstract over here you can read the abstract of this uh, paper and if you wish to read this further if you find enough interest in it you can download this pdf okay okay so the next thing i want to share with you is that you'll need something as per google scholar so let's just go google scholar so uh, google scholar is uh, actually a search engine made by google for research articles and all research purposes you'll find every article and every paper research paper in any field in this uh, google scholar and as you can see the articles of COVID-19, these are all free to read now because India, all the world is in great trouble. So they uh, uh, gave uh, open access to every article which is being published in this uh, journal. So let's just say we want to read something about mock review article. So as you can see that you, there are numerous, numerous research uh, articles here cited by 751 371 mobs there are number of pages there so you can just go there read whatever is in it and if you find find enough interest in it you can go and have a read further and to tell you about the references Let's just say I have this paper with me. Okay, let's just say I have this paper with me, and uh, if you wish to know where are the references, so references are usually given at the end of the paper. So these, so these are called references. So you can find these numbers in the text 7172 if they mention it then you can actually copy uh, this whole thing and paste it on your google scholar and you'll get this paper or article whatever you need so that's all so if you like this video please hit the like button let us know if this video was helpful to you at all and if you have any questions you can always comment on us we'll like we'll definitely uh, we are uh, we will definitely get back to you with all your on uh, with all the answers you need as much as possible and if you really uh, feel that we are doing some important stuff please share the video with your friends and all those who need it maybe this can be life changing for uh, many people if you if you the faster the earlier you start the earlier you gain is that isn't that correct so if you really like it please share it and thank you so much inspire chemistry